and 15 minute delays. Headlines now as we go into today all the way through the weekend. A nice day. You can't beat this Halloween. We'll be uh, very close to our seasonal averages turning much colder by tomorrow. We're talking about 15 to 20 degrees colder, actually below average. That is once we go into tomorrow afternoon, our average for tomorrow is 74 degrees. So that kind of gives you an idea of where we're going to be for daytime highs. And here you go right here. Here's how it's going to play out today. We'll see a cold front approaching from the west. Nice and warm conditions today. Most spots mid 70s cold front moves through and this is a strong cold front. This area originated uh, well up into the Arctic and it'll dive southward and we're talking about the coldest air we've seen so far this fall season. We will not get out of the 50s tomorrow. 54 to 58 degrees. Also feeling colder in those 50s with that blustery northwest winds of 20 to 25 miles per hour. Probably feeling more like in the 40s throughout the afternoon tomorrow with those strong gusty winds and along coastal areas there will be gale warnings that will go up throughout the day on Saturday. Temperatures to start the day is in the mid 40s like in Stakesburg 48 for Metter, but most spots starting out between about 52 and 54 degrees. And here's a look at that storm tracker forecast today. Enjoy your Halloween. We'll see temperature by 5, 8 o'clock 53 mostly clear skies. Lots of sunshine today 74 degrees for daytime highs and then as we go into tonight into the evening we'll see a temperature of 59 degrees so we will see a mostly clear skies throughout the evening. Cold front back off to the west and that will allow for that cold air to move uh, south. I really don't see a whole lot of rain with this entire event even with a cold front and a low that will be moving just to the north of us throughout the day tomorrow. But once you look at the a future radar, it is showing it's going to play out today nice and clear, not showing any clouds all the way through the afternoon at 4 o'clock. We jump ahead into the evening. Great weather also for your trick or treaters uh, for tonight as well with evening temperatures in the 50s and then also for those high school football games tonight. 5 o'clock tomorrow morning, the cold front moves through before sunrise. Once the front moves off the coast, you can see at 4 o'clock tomorrow afternoon there will be some clouds. I do anticipate at times tomorrow we could become mostly cloudy, especially late morning and throughout the afternoon as a lot of cold air aloft be moving right across our area and just a slight chance for maybe a sprinkle or a shower and then we'll get it all out of here and Sunday shaping it be pretty nice with plenty of sunshine but remaining below average and here's another look at the weekend forecast only 56 degrees for average temperatures tomorrow and it'll be windy, a cold afternoon, lots of sunshine there on Sunday with a temperature of 62 degrees. And here is a look at the Storm Tracker seven day forecast for tomorrow. Like I said, it'll be a cold one, 62 Sunday, but won't last too long. These chilly temperatures rebounding very nicely once we get into the, especially the middle of next week, back up into the upper 70s for Wednesday and also for Thursday. Well, I'm looking forward to Wednesday.